All right, so we are live, I think. So, <laughs> hello, welcome hello. all to our hello, chat. hello to Jenny, Melissa, Martin, and especially to Charlotte from the Netherlands for joining us today and for the video and for the song. Hey there. Great to have you all here. Hello, Hans. Hello, Hans. <laughs> hello, hello, Melissa. <laughs> hey all right. Oops. Oh, there's so many people watching and commenting already. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh, wow. Hello, everyone. Hello. Hello, Hi. familiar names <laughs> and new names. Some familiar <laughs> ones. Hello to all of you. <laughs> yeah, it's cool. Thank wow. you for joining us. Yeah. So, Charlotte, since you're yeah. the guest here in the band, what was your first thought when we first asked about the song about Maybe? Oh, well, I was uh, very close to my annual uh, The Lord of the Rings screening because oh. that's, a, that's a December thing for me. And we did, uh, or at least for the vocals, I did the recordings uh, beginning of December. And then um, we recorded the video in December. And then, then the annual uh, watching of the entire trilogy in one day. So it was a, it was a perfect timing. Oh, really? You do it every year? Every year, yeah. Oh, that's yeah. amazing! I didn't know. <laughs> yeah, usually either Christmas or January first because it's the day where you do nothing because of potential hangovers. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, it's a perfect day for for viewing. And uh, oh, that's so cool! I I only did it once, like watching all three extended editions editions in a row. Wow! Really just, but every year, that's quite. Impressive. We did it last yeah, year. Yeah, sometimes it takes me two days to get through them, but once you start, you know, you have to you have to follow up. You cannot you cannot leave them somewhere halfway, yeah. you know, halfway to battle. That's just cruel. Um, yeah. So, but I was excited, uh, and I had the, uh, heard the Game of Thrones uh, version, of course. So I was very excited about what you were going to do to metalize the track. And uh, it was very, very cool. It was very impressed. So uh, yeah, very happy to join. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> wow. Well, yeah, well, it wasn't easy to transform that particular song into a metal tune mm -hmm. because of the original being so slow and empty. And you know, Melissa knows yeah. what I'm talking about. <laughs> yeah, yes, we, we, we had, I think, three final versions between we chose uh, before we chose the real final version very different versions yeah. and very different tempos and and feels yeah. Yeah. Mm. so what made you land on this one specifically what, what were the biggest differences between the the three versions i think it just felt like it was the right energy for every part because what we tried before was either working for the verse but not for the chorus or working for the chorus but not for the verse and then mm -hmm. we tried to kind of make it more um, adventurous so it would work for all these parts um, yeah to find the right energy for each part and um, and it, it and it worked but it And, um, and the skeleton before we uh, we we joined in. Yeah, I think you two you you also participated in the in the in the building of the skeleton. Yeah. I was more like, I like it. I don't like that. No, you're right. <laughs> well, Martin played a major role in finding a groove and something for the verse and for the chorus. I think. Yeah, we all we all did it together. We all did it. Yeah, we, all did it. You, we already had a very finished version. Allowed to change too many things it has to kind of follow the um, original what, arrangement. The, yeah. the 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 original arrangements, mm -hmm. and so my idea was kind of put in the in the in the background for a while. And I was like, oh, can we just try it? And um, and then you guys did the magic for this because, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was a fun process. It was a, uh, it took longer than we thought it would, but uh, yeah. it was definitely worth it. Because the original yeah. sounds so easy because it has nothing besides some yeah. mood sounds and the vocals. So it's, uh, 
easy task. But yeah, it wasn't so that easy. easy. Yeah. yeah. So, Jenny, so now it's uh, mo much more energetic. Yeah, yeah absolutely. It, I think it turned around like 180%. And I'm mm -hmm. super curious about all, what all the people are going to say about it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Especially because it's plastic, so it's kind of dangerous and exciting at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's a lot of comments now. Oh yeah, yeah. we should read. Everything from pussified metal to <laughs> pussified metal. Pussified metal. Can you hear it? There's not yeah. enough pussified metal in the world. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah, I think there's a lag. Someone says there's a lag. I don't know if it's oh, for everyone. Really? Oh. <laughs> there's um <laughs> i'm sorry I, I i read is the lag for everyone and i had metal is for everyone in my head at the same time <laughs> completely uh yeah jenny how is yeah. it how, how is it for you to be a harp player in a metal band <laughs> i think i've never heard from a harp player in in any metal band or i'm wrong do you know? I don't know. Elevati is is a uh, is Fabi playing the harp with Elevati? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Okay. Ah, okay. Cool. Yeah. It it when you asked me to play in a metal band as a harpist, this was like my biggest dream came true. So mm -hmm. all these hard sounds came together in in the combination with the holy sound of the harp, and. The symbiosis of this is so so great. I think it opens a new world of heart and uh, and clear and like a fairy tale with the metal together. So yeah, I think it fits very really, very well because the mood the harp creates fits very well. The mood usually metal is going to create. It's a different instrument, obviously, mm -hmm. but 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 the outcome creates the same sort of feelings, I think. And so it fits actually very well together on the second look. On the first look, you might yeah. wonder why, well, how should that work? But if you think more about it, I think it works perfectly. Yeah, mm -hmm. for me, yes. It's also when you have the hard metal metal parts and you, you go and celebrate this, and then it comes to like to a break and where you go into yourself and like this little silence, and then you start with the hard music again. So and the, the harp makes this this little break with of deeper silence and then you go back to the mm -hmm. the hard stuff yeah, i love it i love the combination really much yeah and often you don't you don't recognize the harp so much but when you put them away then you see what it did to the music yeah because yeah. the harp is always a little bit like in the background and it opens a new world in the background but if you put it away then something really important is missing like so mm. I'm very glad that I'm here with you. That's great. <laughs> I think it's important also to mention all the work that Jenny is doing for the for the videos, because um, um, the the video uh, for Jenny and the video for Maid B uh, have both been done by our Jenny and uh, <laughs> fantastic work. Very very efficient team, yeah. and it was always very nice to work with the team. So very very nice. <laughs> <laughs> Very, yeah. Everybody is so so directly involved and very yeah. very dedicated in the whole team, and it's very very nice people to work with. Mm -hmm. And we had a really big team this time, actually. Yeah, yeah. we did. With the with the yeah, horse and, and and the lighting guys, so mm. and the extras, and then yeah. people coming from Denmark and from the Netherlands. <laughs> <laughs> Drones. Drones, yeah. Even. Drones, horses. <laughs> Drones with horses. I was very scared. It could also be go really, really wrong. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And um, yeah, the the I don't know why we always shoot those videos in the in the winter, but uh, <laughs> the the weather was uh, was challenging for especially for Jenny, Charlotte, and I because we were. Filming those story parts, uh, bare feet in the forest, <laughs> yeah. and then for the rest of the band in the evening as well for um, the, the the band shots. But it was fun anyway. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so so did you guys ever got the feeling back in your toes or no? <laughs> oh no, they're cuts now. 
They're cut off. Yeah, <laughs> oh, okay, I don't yeah. even need my toes anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Who needs toes anyway, right? Who needs toes? <laughs> Just <Marty>. more eat it. <laughs> Yeah, I I put my uh, feet on the belly of the horse. <laughs> well, oh, yeah, well, I did this too. On the horse riding scenes, but then the horse thought that it was a, a command, you know. So every time I tried <laughs> to warm my feet, it was like, oh, okay, here we go. I was like, no, I'm just trying to keep warm. <laughs> you can yeah. So. Hans, someone is asking if it's a if it's a old hat or a new hat. It's my indoor hat, actually. Oh, okay. oh. Well, my outdoor hat, the fresh ones, is a new one, a leather hat. But this okay. is my old hat, which I actually use for, for Dark Side of the Moon and indoors. Like when I'm at home, I'm always wearing this hat yeah, because I'm okay. never out of a hat. No, so, you know, folks are speculating what is what is beneath the hat, but yeah. I guess we'll never know. Some, some, <laughs> someday I will reveal. Maybe a dragon bird. Or a dragon bird. bird. I'm not. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to read the questions. Don't mind me. Yeah, there's a lot of questions, it seems. Yeah, someone asked about the video. DreamWorks did the video. So, Jenny, this is for you. <laughs> Could you take over for a minute? I have good. Yeah. yeah, it's the Dream Film Factory, we are called. Me and my best two friends my from the school, we, are, we made this. Um, little company when we are were studying and we wanted all the time to make like dream dreamy things to came true Me, and that's the best thing what could happen music videos are all the time like fantastic and a little bit horror and this is everything what we ever wanted to do like to make movies in a short time and creative and not normal <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think it did look very, very good. You've also done um, the campus video, right? For yes, for Feuerschwanz. Yeah. Oh, I loved it. The Krampus. It looks like the devil. He was so beautiful. <laughs> he was nearly <laughs> three meters high. <laughs> That's a great video, too. I was really jealous because Steffi, our um, violin player, could dance with with him and this was oh. my dream to dance with the devil <laughs> maybe <laughs> one time in our video we have a devil too <laughs> hashtag goals <laughs> yeah someone asked you jenny uh, if you have tips for playing harp when it's cold outside and how you get your fingers to stay oh nimble this was in the cold i was really crying it was awful um i think this little hand warmers you, you keep this hand warmers and in your bag and when the song starts you have immediately to start playing so they can't get cold and when you have a break put it again into the to the hand with the hand warmers but it was really challenging because I, they was like really frozen because we were outside all the day like eight to ten hours and we were working outside also filming so this was more special than like when you're doing maybe a show because then you're not all the time outside and wait 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 and then you have to play then you have yeah. more chance to get the fingers warm <laughs> but i think yeah, the cold, the, sorry the cold, i think the cold look you see that it's cold in winter and it fits the video it wouldn't have worked yeah. it would have been in summer everything so. for the video <laughs> <laughs> uh, i saw a question i don't remember who uh, asked uh, about touring uk in particular what was the question? Um, it, it's if we're going to tour, and the question was in particular about the UK. If we are going to tour in the UK, of course, <laughs> one day we will. <laughs> yeah, there will, there will be live shows happening. Yes. Uh, would it be better to shoot the video in the middle of summer? Yes. <laughs> Short no. answer. <laughs> no. But it wouldn't look as good, I think, probably. No, it would look very different with the with the landscape. And everything would be green and happy and, and stuff. Yeah. So I'm not sure. Yeah. It doesn't work. The same mood. It's not, not so metal. It's not so metal. Summer <laughs> is not metal. <laughs> maybe for a different type of video. <laughs> yeah, maybe. I, I yeah. hope so too, yeah. Maybe a mermaid video, I don't know. And with the sea in with my own. Underwater person. video. 
Maybe you should, yeah. we should do a Disney song with mermaids or something, and then we <laughs> go oh. for summer. Oh. I, uh, I, I've done an underwater video not too long ago. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. It was challenging, I can say. The only thing I really had to do was sink and pretend to be drowned, um, which, uh, yeah, I've been coughing up pool water for a week after that, I think. <laughs> Mm. But again, you know, it's worth it. So it's worth it. The things we do for art. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There was someone who asked a question earlier regarding at, uh, an album, like a, 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 a full on album. Um, if there would be an album at some point. Well, I think we're working on it, on it right? It uh, would seem so, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's what we're doing a lot lately. <laughs> yeah. There is no no date yet, but it will happen. Yeah. Yes. And um, well. I think we can say without saying too much that we are preparing um, a majority of songs from movies, from series, from video games and a, a few original songs as well. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, we will keep releasing maybe a few more before the album is out so we can keep teasing people and uh, and enjoy also seeing the guesses about which song from which movie it will be. It's which really guest might feature. Which guest might be featured so as well. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Will this, the current singles be available on platforms like Bandcamp? Oh. Good question. Oh, I don't oh. know anything about Bandcamp anymore. Well, it's on Spotify and iTunes. And Calling stuff. Napalm. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just say this one thing to all the, the people out there. It's okay to stream. Just yes. you're allowed to stream. Don't feel bad about streaming our music. It's <laughs> totally fine. <laughs> yeah, there's this misconception that streaming is bad for artists, but streaming is not bad for artists. No. <clears throat> Just stream a lot. <laughs> stream a lot and also yeah. buy the albums, of course. It would know, just be stuff. even better if Spotify payouts would be better, but it's still good. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But uh Ben Camp, I know that I know that Napalm releases the, the albums on Ben Camp. I just don't know if the singles are there already. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. It's definitely out on iTunes and, and, and Spotify yeah. stuff, but I have to check if it's on Ben Camp. But good question. I think it will be there if once the album is out, it will be in, on Bandcamp. Yeah, so yeah. I'm not, not just not sure if it's now. What I wanted to ask you, Charlotte and, and Melissa, oh. about your experience riding a horse for almost the first time, I think. Ooh, yes. You want to start, Melissa? <laughs> <laughs> because I remember some two very happy faces after doing the shots for the... Uh, we were like little kids. I, I, I mean, I was so happy. My my aunt had a, um, well, some sort of a farm and we could ride one of the horses growing up. And it was like the very, very old, very mild tempered horse. And it would carry around the kids and move like very slowly. Uh, but that's that's the only experience that I've had, which is close to nothing. So I was slightly nervous, but um, I mean... I adore animals and the horses are fucking majestic. So, uh, yeah, I was really, really excited about the opportunity to be riding a horse barefoot in a pretty dress, you know? <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm a simple woman. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, it was, it was really exciting. And, uh, and the horse was, uh, on our best behavior as well. So that was, that was really great. Yeah. Leslie. Yeah. Leslie, the horse. Yeah. Uh, for me, it was pretty much the same. I mean, I, the only experience I had with horses was when I was a kid at school, you had this, um, it was called the vacation passport. And every year during the summer, you could choose activities and you could discover animals and 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 also create some some something with um you could melt iron and do some yeah some interesting stuff and that's my only experience with horses so right before the video i was looking at youtube 
tutorials because I don't I didn't want to be this the you know the stupid <laughs> person you know that makes the the horse suddenly run and I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so I was like okay what are the things that I should absolutely not do yeah but you did well and I think Steffi <clears throat> who's, who's a violin player of Feuerschwanz it's her horse actually and she said the horse was so proud being there the horse didn't want to leave actually because yes. the, the horse was in the center of attention and everybody was oh the horse is so cute and, ta -ta -ta. And, and, and it was so happy just being in the video and being the center of everything <laughs> it was so getting cool. treats so yeah. many treats <laughs> <laughs> well, oh you bribed it okay i see <laughs> just a little bit just a little bit <laughs> Uh, there was a cool question you said. Uh, Melissa, oh, no, hello, Tank. Tank. Tank is here. Hello, oh. Tank. Oh, hi, Tank. Oh, hello, Tank. <laughs> Tank the Tech. Tank the Tech. Yeah. Uh, how did you arrange vocal harmonies? Did Melissa arrange it all, or did the two of you work it work it out together? Um, actually, did we do it at at your place, Hans? Mm, I don't remember, but I think um, <clears throat> yeah, I, I don't remember how we did, do, did it. Actually. Or maybe I did it. At, I think at <clears throat> I, I think you you did the background vocal arrangements and yeah, how yeah. you how you how the vocals are split up. Yeah. Because I know nothing about vocals, you know. I'm just a guitar player. <laughs> no, but I was wondering there. because we recorded some stuff when you, when we were in Germany. But I guess I I guess I just did it at home and I first yeah, recorded I so. the, the original vocals and then. Um, imagine some some harmonies to fit two two voices together. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't think I've ever went recording any guest thing with adjusting so little. Like all oh. of the harmonies, they work perfectly, and they work perfectly in my range as well. It was like, how do you say it? Like like a very nicely like a made bed. I could just go ahead and jump in, and everything was. Uh, Everything worked perfectly. Nice. So we should make it a little bit harder next time. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a challenge. <laughs> no, it was perfect. I really love the love the the vocal arrangement and the cool. really cool. I think and you did. Uh, it was. I'm sorry. No, go ahead. No, it's funny because the, there was one. Uh, floating instruction with ad libs and you were like yeah i did something might be a little bit dramatic and, we're oh, like, and that is, yeah that's the one thing i did add. <laughs> and you were like yes <laughs> yeah i was like i love it more drama <laughs> yeah. yeah there was a there was a, a kind of a scream no it's not a scream but like a loud ad lib towards the end um, yeah but yeah. it's so cool it works very very well <laughs> thank you <laughs> Trying to check out. Where did the horse take you? I, I, well, to, around the pond. To yeah. the Grey Havens. <laughs> to yeah. to Grey Havens, yeah. To the Undying Lands. I like this. Yeah. I quit horses when I was abducted by one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. The keeper spent three hours looking for me after it ran away with me on its back. Oh, no. <laughs> Well, so sorry, Andre, for your <coughs> bad experience. Oops. Yeah, feel very sorry for you. Sorry. Bad horse. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I should not laugh, but it's kind of <laughs> imagining. Sorry. Uh, it was a holiday spot in the bush belt, so I traveled a long way all around the fence. Well, you know, at least you um, you got to see a lot during your holiday, I guess. Nice. Um, yeah. <laughs> so will will the horse now become a band member? Oh. It would be interesting. Yeah. I wonder Should how you would fit in the nightliner in the bus. What is that? Yeah. yeah. She gets the trailer in the backside. Extra tailor, trailer, trailer, yeah. <clears throat> Maybe some percussive uh, cut the clop, cut the clop, cut the clop. Yeah. Oh, right. Wow. Like man of war riding in on their motor yeah. bikes, kind of yeah. all ride on in on on on, on one horse. <laughs> 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 Maybe oh, there's a French question, M Melissa. Uh, I don't see it. 
Do you mean from Fabrice? Yes. But if you can read it to me, I will. Uh... <laughs> Hans, it's your turn. <laughs> It was. It would be fine to hear it, Hans. Try it. Oh. Yes, please. <laughs> Salut, Melissa. PC depuis la Suisse près de Chalon. Je oh. t'ai envoyé un papier de modèle en pensée et sa l'autorisation et tout le reste de l'équipe pour ce formidable morceau pas et à venir. Wow. Have you, have you learned French? Did you understand what I was saying? I I think I understood. Um, I, I didn't. Most of it. But, uh, <laughs> Bonjour, Fabrice. <laughs> yeah, it was very nice. Nice. Well, I had I had French in school until like ah. two years or something, but it's oh. long ago. <laughs> I never had French. For me, it sounded perfect. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I would. I was preparing, preparing for this to be very funny, but it just sounded good. <laughs> okay, nice. I, I I don't don't know what it, it says. <laughs> And someone is uh, saying now the translation. Yeah, please, uh, Hans, uh, do translate. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, there's uh, someone saying that we should not put candles around horses. Oh, there weren't candles around him. Horses in fire don't mix, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I don't think there was any fire. No. Mm -hmm. I like that. No. No, we had fires during the night. Yeah, yes, not, not the during the day. Mm -hmm. No, 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 just the forest. There was no horse, horse during the night. The horse was a heavy horse. Okay. Just three yeah. minutes left. Yes. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh, getting close. Ooh. Ooh. When will you play a live concert? Mm. Well, I guess when uh, the album is out. Yeah. We'll probably organize a nice release party or something. Party. Yeah, we shall see. <laughs> something, something will happen. It will happen, yeah. But first, we'll finish the album and then we we'll play <laughs> live. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What is your favorite harp, Jenny? My favorite harp? It's a good question because I let them build from a harp builder. And so I didn't try, especially other harps from other builders i really trust trust him he's a little it's a little tiny company and i go there and i explain him what i really like to hear and what it should sound and in this time i have been there also and we are creating a new harp for me and oh. i will do the design the painting design on it that's exciting nice. yeah i'm so waiting for it <laughs> Yeah. Oh, and I, I just saw that we received a, a, a message saying that it's going to be on Bandcamp, just to answer the previous question. Oh, okay. Oh. <clears throat> Someone asked if that said gig would be at a castle. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, not impossible. <laughs> <laughs> could be one of the inflated castles, you know, but it could also be a real castle. We have a lot of castles in Germany. Oh, yes. would be a good setting. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not promising anything. <laughs> <laughs> would be fun, though. One minute. Ooh, Ooh. Yes. Well, so I would say thank you for joining you, uh, yes. for joining us here. And um, <laughs> hopefully you will like the video. And actually, it's a song about hope, a song about hope and light in dark places. So I think everyone can need it at the moment a little bit that's yeah. true yeah. So. thank you everyone for joining yes thank you very much thank Enjoy you and thank you guys for having me yeah thank, so, you, thank you so much for joining and, and to being yeah. in the song, right. in the song. Oh, yes. <laughs> happy release day yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's still 20 seconds i, th I think i was too early <laughs> <laughs> oh i just